It is a TV powered by World Sports Betting. It is the Times, CO.ZA, Milford, Knockout, Kaiser Chiefs in the net bank cup on penalties. Um, it's close to 10 o'clock for a game that was supposed to end at 8 p.m. because there's extra time and this and that. And we've been dragged into it. But well done to the NFT team. They move on to the next round of the net bank cup. Uh, Machakalaga, what did you make of the game, sir? Uh, looks, uh, sorry. I'm sorry to cut you. Oh, I'm sorry to cut you. Because it's the second time. It's the second consecutive nil nil na lama penal to suga na ubuya ne bad luck as Ivory Coast was an Iwap for the second time since last now last week still in our nil nil Royal AM. Now I'm trying to still in our omnu nil nil ubuya ne bad luck Ivory Coast. No, it's not me. It's these teams. It's Chiefs and also it's Bafana Bafana that went to the penalties. I was just there to give them support, and I'm here also today to support the Lama boys. Go to the ocean. No, no, no. Them, they must go there. Not me. No, 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 no. Me, I'm okay. Good looks. I'm relaxed. Just, it's, it's, it's very hot in the studio tonight. Uh, yes, I must feel the hot. Uh, I, I must feel the heat because uh, of what just transpired uh, tonight. Because what some people are being just so and Agahawa. Lewa, I'm my brother. Yeah, man. Good looks. Um, I don't want to go back, man. I don't want to talk about the Easter players. Because I did talk about them uh, last week. So embarrassing uh, tonight against Milford. Uh, before uh, the, at the time I reached here, I told you that in Gulux, uh, I'm expecting to score five goals uh, because uh, based on uh, uh, what other teams played before us. So I didn't see Milford giving us a challenge. And Egbona uh, Horne, hopefully, got this is the last cup uh, uh, in the cabinet. Uh, not ship's cabinet, in the other cabinet to say now maybe this cup is the one that will be lifting, the, uh, lifting come the end of the uh, this tournament. So even Johnson, I was just wishing him all the best because he's in the hot seat. So coming to the game, Gulu's first half could even say, I mean, uh, I, 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 even Johnson made some changes. I mean, Rabone they were there, Mashiani, and also Teto was back, Guiniga was back, unlike in the previous games. So even Saile, uh, all the time, Gulugs here is on the right flank. What it does, it doesn't want to uh, cut inside. Always, uh, they want to uh, cross the balls. Crossing for who? And also, he was unlucky as well, and to uh, do bridge just to put the ball in the back of the net. He was unlucky there. He did stretch his leg. Unfortunately, the ball didn't go in, in the back of the net. So, coming the second half, all those changes in the second half, they played the game like we played when uh, uh, Medentorp was still there in the hot seat, and also, uh, they, they remind me of Ozuan as well, and also uh, Gavin Hunt. You know, aerial football, whereby you play the ball in the far left and the far right. Even uh, again, uh, Dubriz, they put him in the, in, on the far right. I mean, wrong position. How can you do such thing? You know, you, you, you killed the boy. He, he, he was not effective as well. Nothing whatsoever. You also made some changes, bringing our Villagaze and others. Abu Mahat, <coughs> do you have quality? That's the first thing that we should do. We should talk about. There's no quality at Kaiser Chiefs. Let me ask you then. Do you have quality in comparison to Milford when you look at those two teams? So in the game that you're facing, you, you are usually a mediocre top five, top six team in the Premier Soccer League. On average, in the last five years, you're always somewhere around there. Now... You versus Milford. You can mention quality in general, maybe in comparison to the top two in the league or in the Cup Champions League, you don't have quality. But you do have quality that's better than Milford. You should have scored against Milford, but you chose the wrong tactics. Um, yeah, the players were not good enough to score. Somehow, uh, you get a penalty as well. Um, handball. Um, in extra time. That's a tap in. We're actually getting up to shoot videos and I'm like, oh, thanks God, this game is over. Yeah. And then you still miss that. But in terms of the question of quality, you have more quality than Milford. Absolutely, you're correct. Yes, we do have Nkuluksi, but uh, is it enough for Kiza Chiefs? Absolutely not. I say absolutely not uh, for a team well, like... Against Milford. 
Uh, I guess Milford, yes, I, could, I, I can say yes, because Milford didn't even offer anything as well on the field of play. They were just sitting at the back. Uh, but one thing that I, I saw as well, because achieving the first half, they were allowing Milford, especially from the back, they were not pressing them hard so that they can make yes. a mistake. But, I mean, they are yes. still young, these guys, inexperienced players, so, but they, you know, they just left them, just doing what they, uh, uh, what they, could, uh, 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 what they please. So, Guluk, all in all, I'm saying, I think we are in big trouble. You know, as, as, as I've said before, back to management, everybody involved uh, could even see the supporters diminish as well. You know, there's no people that want to go and watch kids at Chiefs, could even see FMBs. FMB big, but supporters were not much. You know, I mean, what takes supporters to go to the stadium? I said it before. So I'm saying to the management, do the right thing. You can even see the team is going down. It's going down and down. So what are we still waiting for? Especially from the technical side of it going straight into the field of play. So there is not enough in Gulooks where you see that the, these are the players that should take his achieve to the highest level. So we are still going to cry. We are still going to cry. As, as I've said, this is the last uh, 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 trophy that I was expecting. Uh, maybe we, uh, we, we can just maybe do something about it, you know, put the smile back to the supporters, but it was not meant to be. The players in Gulooks that are playing for his achieves are not the right players that should continue playing for Kisa Chiefs. There should be a lot of changes uh, on the field of play. Chiefs must just go back and rectify whatever they rectify. Go to the drawing board. If there's a drawing board at uh, Nechorena, uh, make sure, my brother, that you get something out of nothing. This is embarrassing for a team like Kisa Chiefs Kaliba. We keep on saying this uh, uh, time and again, Golusi. Yeah. Uh, this is embarrassing, I must say. Yeah, you mentioned something important, actually. Um, the replenishment of the playing squad. Uh, players being ordinary. Now, here's the thing. We've just gone past February. If you needed to do anything in terms of the players, you would have needed to do it in January. Uh, to me, this smells like a team that's unwilling to spend money. You are around or surrounded by your competitors, the big clubs, Sundowns, Pirates. Um, they're spending, Sundowns spent maybe 50 million. I don't know, they had a player from outside, two players from outside, actually, one from Europe, one from South America. You could assume that there's somewhere in the region of 50 million, maybe 70 million. You guys spent zero. So the teams that are already better than you, they are improving. They are significantly better than you. You're not even in the same building with them. Maybe they are in the first floor. You are on a different floor. But they were improving. Why? You see now you're talking about players. Yeah. You didn't do that business during January. Yeah. Yeah, well, which is then saying, and the coach kept on saying he's happy with the players that he has. That means there is a, a distance between how the fans see it and how the management sees it. Maybe the management doesn't mind what has happened tonight. No, it's embarrassing, Guluks, uh, once again. I mean, even, even the coach says that uh, Guluks, uh, now I think he's in the hot, hot, uh, hot water now. Of course, you can't say that. I mean, we really chance to send us some other players whereby you see that, you know what, we are lacking, especially in the middle of, of the park, we are lacking uh, up front, whereby those strikers that could make sure that they hit the target. There's nothing. I mean, you've got people like Wesha Ivory that they shoot uh, uh, from outside the Aiden area, but doing nothing. But let's congratulate first Emily Ford, you know, and even their keeper for saving uh, that Shiva Viro penalty. I mean, Shiva Viro, I mean, it's experience, my brother. I think he played even with this uh, Confederation oh, Cup. So, so, I mean, we are up against Milford, a, 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 a goal, goal keeper. Inexperienced, I mean, uh, I'll say, a keeper. So, why can't you do that? Why can't you just score that penalty? You don't go, need to go to extra time. My brother, how many connections did Kiza Chiefs get? Number one. Number two, how many freaky, how many set pieces? In all those things, what happened with that? Nothing. There was nothing at all in groups. So, all in all, my brother, uh, the supporter that went to FMB Stadium, I feel sorry for them once again. But Kiza Chiefs, must change, they must they must change my brother if they want to compete uh, with teams like Sundowns and Paris and other teams within the PSL it was now Chiefs is an ordinary, ordinary team it's not like Chiefs like like we've supported before if you go to the stadium looks you're expecting results but once again Milford you've done well all the best right, so there you go um, yeah Milford has moved on to the next round not that they really did anything special um, they strike this game just like Bafana Bafana, two extra time and then hope for the best. Uh, that has short legs. If it wins a tournament, um, you win it and you may never win anything else ever again. Um, you can go and ask Greece um, what happened to them after the Euros and any other team that has just relied on luck uh, with tournaments. But of course, 
biggest day in the history of Milford. Uh, if you check the date, 25 February 20, 2024, that's their biggest day because they eliminated the biggest team in South African football, the most supported team in South African football. It is good time. It is good time. Thank you for watching us.